the spiritual eye, portal to the higher realms, Paramahamsa Yogananda. As self-realization students know, when your spiritual eye is open in meditation, you see the astral light of the spiritual eye as a ring of golden radiance encircling a sphere of opalescent blue, and at the center, a five-pointed silvery white star. If you can penetrate that star, you are immediately in God's kingdom in the astral world. So learn to concentrate and meditate deeply. Though the spiritual man experiences the physical world and works through the instruments of the physical body, he does not identify himself with any sensation of the body. He is always centered in the spiritual eye. I never take my mind away from there, no matter what I am doing. Always look at the spiritual eye. If you keep your mind there, the calming and spiritualizing influences flowing from the astral world will make you a different person than you are now. Don't have restless shifty eyes. If your eyes are always distractedly looking everywhere, your mind is likewise wandering. Eyes that are constantly blinking reflect the consciousness of a nervous individual. Keep your mind calm and centered at this point between the eyebrows, not flitting restlessly in matter. Even when you are sleeping, your mind should be at that spiritual center. If your body and mind are still in meditation and you keep your gaze and attention turned upward to that point, you will experience the blessings of the astral world consciously. That is why saints in ecstatic communion are depicted with upturned gaze, looking up into heaven. By concentrating on the spiritual eye in deep meditation, one can penetrate into that higher dimension. Your astral body is there now, though your mind and physical body are here. You depend on what you can see with your two physical eyes, and that keeps you continually deluded. If you look into the spiritual eye, you will know the true nature of everything, and can receive the right answers in business and all other matters. You can use this power all the time. It is unlimited within you. When you live at will, in that astral world, you will be guided by the Supreme.